Hey everybody and welcome back to Concept Journey, I'm André Pelais and this is episode 18. Ok, so for this week's episode I will talk about mindset and I will let a rendering process go through the background while I talk about it. What I'm finding out about talking about this subject is that a very hard subject to talk about. And this is probably the tenth time that I tried this, to record this this voiceover, and this will be my my last one. I have all my thoughts uh, organized now. And why is that hard to talk about? Well, mindset is a very personal thing. It's the way that you react to things that happen to you. It's the way that you set your mind to be more positive, more negative, or um, let yourself be carried through the mood of the day or this kind of stuff and of course that I can talk here about hours uh, on how I take things, how I uh, relate to my own mindset and give you tips on how to have a more positive feedback on life and how to improve uh, the quality of your mindset when it comes to art but that doesn't mean that it will really help you what I found is that if you have a, a certain type, type of mindset, it is very hard to change. It's very hard to be like, like myself and as an example. I'm a very positive person. I see work of other people that are way better than me. And I for never for one second I think that I will never achieve that level of art. Uh, I always see every, every artist's job as an inspiration. I always go through uh, a lot of different artists that do things that are completely unrelated to mine and I got ins get inspired by basically anything I see character art, I have an idea for a vehicle I see environment art, I get another idea I have a, a very positive feedback on anything that I see but there are people that are not like that there are people that see somebody else's work and they get depressed because they think that they will never be able to achieve that there are people that put themselves so much, um, they put pressure themse in themselves so much that they they create unre unreal expectations about how they should do and about how they their art should improve. And that's the point that I that I wanted to touch. As I told you, I have a very positive feedback. I have a very positive mindset. And for those of you who are not that lucky, if you if you are like me, I, I think that you will relate to this. But if you are not, uh, I have only one tip for you. And that's basically stop being so hard on yourself. Stop thinking that the world will end if you produce a bad work. Stop thinking that uh, great artists never produce bad work or they never practiced before or that they get to the level that they are right now on a year or two. Go easy on yourself. I know that uh, you want to produce great work. Of course that we all want. And we all uh, strive for that. We all strive for quality. We, are, we all strive for work that inspires uh, other artists. But take it easy. Don't worry. We all have bad days and we all have good days. The, this is way more about how you take them and how you do your art on each one instead of producing great work no matter what. Um, the way that I take things and of course that I recommend this because it's working for me but it might not work for you, you would have to try but the way that I see is that even on bad days I try to produce something I try to, um, as an example, the video that's going on today this is not my most inspired day ever this is just a practice, this is nothing, uh, nothing going on I don't have pressure to do this I, I don't think that I will post this, I don't think that I... In fact, that the, the way that I am showing you this, I, I didn't plan for that. I was recording for the sake of recording, because I was trying to do... I was trying to test my computer to see if it, if it could handle uh, some, uh, a couple of programs going on at the same time. And I started doing this, and I put Spotify on the on the background for me and YouTube and a lot of different things to see if my computer could handle that and 
I just, in on a relaxed mood, I started producing this work. And this kind of stuff is what I would do on a bad day. It's just practicing. It's just uh, trying to do something. I think that's way more important than putting pressure on yourself. Because if you are already having a, a bad day, uh, putting a lot of pressure on you will only have a, a bad effect. If you are having a good day, it can maximize the effects, of course. You can, you can produce a lot more work if you are on a good day. But don't worry about it. This is not about it. This is not about uh, one day or not. This is about the whole journey as a, as a unit. This is about producing great work uh, on the overall. Don't worry. Take it easy. This is art after all. You are doing this because you find it fun. You find it uh, nice. The it's the work that we want to do for the rest of our lives. Or at least I hope so. <laughs> and yeah, I will stop rambling right now. Otherwise, I will talk about this video. I'll talk about this topic for 10 hours straight and we'll never get anywhere. But I think that you, you got where I'm getting it. That's the basic way that I that I like to think about things, and yeah, I know I know the the commentary starts to get um, a little bit random at some point, but I hope that you can still find something useful about it, because I just put the way that I think outside, and if you relate to that or not, please let me know, because this is a topic that I, as I told, it's very hard to talk about. And I feel like uh, it's not a lot of people that talk about it on a, in a good way. People usually say that uh, only do's and don'ts. And the way that I like to think is more sort of a tips and a guide rails instead of, um, instead of blocking things out. And just letting you know that yeah, of course, everybody will have bad days. It's not about that. It's about how you take them and how you, uh, you relate that to your own life. But that's going to be it for today. I hope you liked the video. And if you do, please don't forget to give the video a like. It will really help me out. And subscribe to see more in the future. Also, don't forget to share this video if you find it useful. If you have any fellow artists that uh, this might help, please uh, link them to the video. It will help me and hopefully help them as well. If you have any comments, suggestions, or if you have anything to say about the way that you take your own mindset, please remember that the comment section below the video is free and open to anybody to talk about. If you want to see more of my work, I will leave my social media links on the description. And that's gonna be it. I hope to see you next week and thank you for watching.